What is going on guys, Tenpin Designs here, and today I'm going to bring you a Cinema 4D tutorial that I think will help out a lot of you, um, oh, stupid thing, I gotta get rid of this, sorry, um, basically this is for putting textures on your text, so basically the first thing I'm going to do here is go over here to MoGraph and get down to my Mo text. put that in, um, I'll change the text to tutorial. And let's just change the font because I really can't stand this font. So we'll just put in Molot. It's a very commonly used font. We'll change the depth to about 50. That looks good. Alright. Now let's move our camera around. Maybe like that. There we go. All right. Next thing you want to do is go down here to your, your materials and either hit fi file new material or just double click in here. I'll bring up the new material and double click on that. Let's make the color red, just like this. And then you want to come down here to texture right here. All right. You want to click this arrow and go to load image now I have to find a nice texture so let's see which ones we got here that one's too tall I'm trying to find a wide one that'll look nice um Just try this one. Alright. You want to hit yes when it says you want to create a copy at the document location. Click that. And then we can change the brightness and the mix strength. We'll go around right there. And then the next thing you want to do is come down here. Or first you have to drag it onto your text. There you go. Now you want to click on your material up here and change your projection to cubic. And that will put it on the front of the text. That's what I always had so much trouble with was actually getting onto the front of the text. It always was on the sides and I had no idea how to change it to get it on the front. So now that it's on the front we can render this out a little bit. And I mean this isn't really the best texture. It's not really the right size but um, you can change this. I'll put that up a little bit and then change it to multiply or subtract, add. Just put it on multiply. Let's actually change this to a different one. Let's go with um this one. Try that. Click yes. That actually looks kind of cool. Now if I move this down. Actually, let's go to add. Change the mix strength. Actually, change the brightness of this. Alright, now we can change the luminance and things. You can just mess around with all this. And uh, give it a nice effect. Just kind of quickly going through this. Take off the specular. And then we can put on a reflection. Bow right there. And make sure this is still on cubic. And render this out. So there you go. You can see the texture on there. So that's about it, guys. If you liked the tutorial, please leave it a like. If you really liked it, leave it a favorite. And tell me in the comments if it helped you out. Alright, guys. I'll see you next time. Peace.